Hi everybody. Today we're making dough. Yes, dough. I will be recording today. My kids want to show you our recipe for making kids dough. Um, I'm sure that a lot of people use this recipe, but this is the recipe that I use. Um, it's easy. It's only three ingredients. All you need is flour, salt, and water. So they are going to show you how to make it today. So first we need two cups of flour. So, so I'll so be doing one and then holding what is one. What is that orange thing? How many cups is that? It's one and a half. It's a half a cup. So how many half a cups make one cup or two cups? Two. No. It's two. No. One. I don't, I'm confused. Four. Yes, four half cups makes two full cups, okay? So, go ahead. I have to flatten it. Wait, hold on. I'll do it like the boy drinks formula. Okay, yeah, we have it's a baby. It's hard to flatten. We have a baby, and his name is Liam. Yep, he's four months old. Just turned four months old on the oh. third. Bernie, you do one, and I'll do You got. You each can do two. So Brian's doing one. Yes, this is going to make a mess, but it's worth it. And you guys, please, please, please like and subscribe. Please. And also share, please. We are trying to get YouTube followers. Um, like, we just started our YouTube channel. We really appreciate you guys watching, and we love you. Okay, so they are on their third half a cup of flour, so one and a half cups so far. And we need two cups, right guys? Yep. The flour is making my hands like soft and stuff. Yep, it will. It will. That's why I like So <laughs> Okay, so how many cups do you have so far? Three. Yep, you have three half cups, so that makes one and a half cups. Yep, you are absolutely right. All right, so you just need one more. Idea, are you doing that one more? Are you going to give it to Brain so I'm he can give pour it? it? I'm just oh, yep, Brain went and got a spoon because we do need that. No, don't do it from that far up. It was on my make... feet. Oh, good job. You made it in the awesome. I sprinkled it on my feet. Okay, so now we are done with the do flour. We Okay, you could put the lid on it. Now, now we need, oh, you need that, the orange cup, the measuring oh. cup, sorry. It's okay. So go ahead and put the cap on there. Brian or Isaiah, one of you guys need to me measure out one cup of salt, please. Can I do it, Brian? So, so okay. far, that, hey, Brian, can you cap this up? I need help. So far, that was two cups of flour. Now we're going to add one cup of salt. So you each can do a half. I thought we needed four. No, no, we we needed four of the flour because it's only a half a cup. Mm -hmm. So for this one, we need one cup, which is two of those. So keep going. You need a full. I oh, don't know. We're gonna waste a lot of salt. Well, That's, not waste. It's not wasting because we're gonna have fun with it, right, guys? Yeah. So fill it all the way up. Fill it all the way up. Yep. Okay. And we we have uh. A small bottle just in case if we run out of that. All right, there you go. Pour that in. Good job. I'm a chef. Now let Brian do some. Oh, wow, we're running out of salt. That's fine. Yep, so that's just fine. Do a full cup. Yep, just pour the rest of it in there. I think the rest of it will do. Good, very good job. Very good. Oh, and that's, that's fine. Just go ahead and pour that in there like that. That'll be all right. Just all the way over. Yep, he's getting all of it out of there because we needed one cup. We didn't really plan this video. Um, the kids wanted to do something fun tonight. Yep. So I decided that, um, you know, we could do this dough video because it's really fun and it teaches people how to make it. So now you want to take the spoon and you want to stir that together. Can I do it or do you want to do it? You can yeah. both, you could take turns doing okay. it. So, so far, what do we have in the bowl, guys? We have flour and salt. How many, how much of each? We have four cups of flour, two, two cups of flour, and one cup of salt. Great job. We also have food coloring down here that we're going to use. These two are the powder, and then we have four. 
um, liquid so once, so, so we're going to have a lot of fun. So you gradually pour the water as Brian is stirring it, just a, a little bit at first. Let's get a close-up of this. Oh yeah, you could pour. Oh, you need to pour that in here first to measure oh. out one cup. Okay. Go ahead and do that. Why I did it all? So That's okay, cause she didn't put much, very much in there. You might need Careful. more water. Let me see where you're at. Right here. Yep, that is one cup. Very good. So I would say pour just a little, like this much of that in there to start. Whoop. Yeah, because you want to gradually do that. A little bit more. Gradually means dip. gradually means dirt. Switch. Gradually means a little bit at a time. Oh okay. yeah. Yep, that's good. A little bit at a time. Oh, we're gonna get a close up here and we're gonna watch oh, this magically turn into some playful kids dough. This is a kid's recipe by the way. It's very safe for kids. Uh, like I said, it's only three ingredients, flour, salt, and water. And then you can add the food coloring if you would like. It just makes it a it's lot more optional. funner for the kids. It's yeah, optional. It is optional. It makes it a lot more fun for the kids. Go ahead and stir or put some more water in there, Brian. You could put more than that, you know, a decent amount. Like that? Oh, wow. Yeah, oh yeah, that's very good. Do you want to hold getting, this for a second? Get a close up of the flour oh. so I can kind of help. It's sissy. getting thick. Yep, yeah, I'm going to help. Can I go in with my hands yet? No, not yet because it's uh -huh. going to be very. Um, we have to pull all the way over. Yeah, can pour some water it? in there. Go ahead right on ahead. That's good. That's fine. Whoa, that, that was wasn't, a lot. Yeah, but it wasn't like all of it. Can you take it? Go ahead and pour some more. Hold on because I'm going to pour for bit. Sissy. She can hold it. You want to hold the. You want to record, get a really good close up of this dough in the making. Should I pour some more? Oh, wow. No, you don't want to pour some more yet. You oh, want to wow. see. Well, you'd start out with one cup just to make sure that, um, you know, because you don't want to put too much water because that will just completely. Ruin. You guys can see it's thick. Yes, it is. So, what we're going to do right now is I'm going to have a daily clean off the spoon with her fingers. Can I go in? Oh, wow, it's warm. Ew. Can I go in? Yep. And I'm going to have... It's like a batter. It's like a batter. Yes, it is. Now I'm going to have both of you go in with your hands yes. and just mix that up real Ooh. good. Feels great, doesn't it? Yes. <laughs> yeah. It feels crunchy. I, I mix, have a Make sure you get all this flour mixed in there. Oh. You want to get all the flour on the what sides mixed in there. What if we need more water? There. I don't think we will. You just need to get really mix it together. Okay. So after you get the three ingredients, which is two cups of flour, one cup of salt, yep. one cup of water, you want to get it into it's a big, ball. It Look feels at like that. Slime. Look at that. That looks so nice. It feels like slime. Yep. You grab a ball. Sissy has a ball. Now you need to knead that. Knead it. Sissy, get I'm all this flour yeah, over here that's oh, stuck mommy, on the ball. Mommy, mommy. I wash my hands. Okay. And no, nope. so some, this no. is what you do, Brian. Get some gloves. It, it, the salt is burning. The salt is burning. Okay, Brian. So now, what is you? You got a little bit of a cut on your hand. Yeah. Oh, yeah. honey. Okay, so if it's really, is that really sticky? Yeah. So you get a little bit of this flour and add it in a little bit at a time because you don't want to make it um too dry. I yeah, have baby. Add that in. Good job, Woo! guys. Good job, baby girl. Now, if it still feels sticky, just add some more flour, okay? Can See, I grab it, from there? Yes. Yep, okay. absolutely. It's not sticking to my hand. Very it's good. It so, but you need to put it down and knead it for like five minutes, which means, you know, really get in there with it. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yours feels really good, Brian. You did a very good job. I'm Mine's so proud of you. Mine's still sticky a little bit. Now, this project, it is, you know, it's, it's a little bit of a messy one. But it is so fun for the kids, especially during this quarantine time. It is very good for them to have something to do, something yeah. that's fun. You can put it in a bowl and um, save it, then put water yeah. in it. Yeah, and you know, it even helps with other stuff. You know, they're learning while they're doing this because they're measuring out, you know, cups and, you know, all that stuff. So they're learning stuff, too. Like, guys, how many, how much is four half cups? Two. Two. Two what? Two, two cups. Two yes, cups. absolutely. See, they learn why they're doing this because they didn't it's know that before. Stretchy. One more pinch, then I'm done. Is it a little sticky? Yeah. Still okay. So, so Isaiah, you probably need some flour, huh? Yeah. I don't really need no more flour. Okay. Did you need it real good? Let me see, babe. I'm needing it right now. Oh yeah. See, that feels good. It's still a little sticky, but you're yeah. you got some flour put in there that yeah. you need to knead in, huh? Yeah. My hands are really warm, so it's kind of affecting it. That's okay. 
if you need flour, you know, don't be afraid to put it in there. Okay. Because once we get it to where it's not very sticky, then we get oh, to do the oh fun part. We get to add the food colorings. Oh, wow. I think I might have made And that. it's going to be so fun. And we can make cookies. So we didn't we know if... We don't know if these powder ones right here are going... These are so beautiful, by the way. But we don't know if they're going to work. Um, because, Brian, you know, it's bowl. not a, a watery... Um, it's not a watery substance, so we don't know if they're gonna if that food coloring is gonna work. But we are gonna try it and see because so it's they are beautiful. Yes, it is experiment, and they are very beautiful, vibrant colors. So we are gonna give those a little try and see. Can I feel yours, sis? I got yeah. to feel Brian's. Side. It's a little bit sticky. Use my hands. Oh, just a little bit, but you still got some flour to need. Yep. Oh, yours see? actually feels really good. Can I see feel yours? Yeah. I feel yours and oh, I yeah. feel mine, Brian. Ooh. Yeah. Okay, so see, you guys look at that, Brian, underneath there. See, mm -hmm. you still got a little bit of flour, so oh. you want to knead that in real good. Okay. Mine, okay, I, so whenever you guys feel like it's not that sticky, here's that. Um, I think I might a little bit. I think I might need a little bit more water. I can feel it. Okay, I'll feel. I'll know if it's yeah. too dry. Give Ooh, me just one this second. This is sticky. See, oh no, sticky. this is actually perfect. This is really? a you want it to be a play doh like feel, and that that is actually, if you, you want me to be honest, you could use a little bit more flour. Right that there. is a lot Eesh. of flour, that's why that bowl is like full. Yeah, so okay, yeah, you want it to be a play doh like substance, so that is not too dry at all. Okay, whenever you guys feel um, that it's time, you can go ahead and I think add some I food. I might be trying one of these two. All right, I'm gonna go in with this to see if it does anything and this if it doesn't blue? i'll add some of that okay because it has like glitter in it so, so do you want to show them which blue you're going in with the i'm going with the liquid blue all right to just test it out awesome okay so do you want to tear a little piece off yes. or do you want to do okay i'm just gonna test so it. she's gonna test this and see how it works i'm gonna i'm gonna try red he's gonna try red we only have a little bit left actually of, green okay he's gonna try green the liquid green right mm -hmm. now are you gonna do it sissy didn't tear a little bit off and test it or you're just gonna go in with it. it. All right. Yep. You could test it. Oh, All they're right. really like testing stuff. Yes, they are doing a fantastic job. I'm Ignore to... my my clothes over there. I gotta do a load of laundry. I have five kids, so sometimes it's you know mom life. Sometimes you like, have a like, load of laundry what? laying around. You know that you need to do. What does what does blue and green make? I forgot. Blue and green? Why don't you go ahead and try it and find out, sweetheart? Blue this is what it's okay. about. I don't want to tell him because I know what it makes, but I'm not going to tell him. This is what it's about, you know? Okay, here's my green piece. Oh, my God, look at it. Look at that. Did now, you want to just... try the powder and see if that works? Yep. I wonder if the powder works. I'm just going to mix this all in real quick. This powder ones are actually for, like, watery substance, but um, I'm He's just really curious to see if they will work. He's going to go in with the blue. you got to take the tape off, honey bun. No. Oh. I taped it closed. Yep. Now you can get a little out, maybe. Mm. Yeah. So these are actually for watery substance, more watery substances. Ooh, it's working. But we're going to try it with this. And it's like can I see, hun? Yeah. Okay, look at that. That's beautiful. Come yes, look at that mine. Is. It's a very light blue. Yes, it is. And that, I think that's pretty, too. Does it stretch pretty far? I'm going to add really. a little no, bit more blue. No, you can stretch it a little bit, but if you go too far, um, it I think it you could stretch so. it better with, like, the plain stuff. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. But now I'm going to try the powder. And then Are you going to go in with the brain one with the blue? Oh, you're going to do the blue too? All right, and let's then see. I'm, I'm going to make like it a It makes slime. a lighter green. I'm going to make a awesome. dust Awesome. That looks so beautiful. I like those two colors together. It kind of looks like earth. <laughs> I'm gonna make blue and green. I'm gonna huh? make a mm, like, beautiful. I'm gonna make a swirl. So okay. Yeah. So and I'm, I'm gonna, gonna make this blue. This so blue. she just put this powdered blue color into this oh, piece this right nice. here. It feels nice. She's gonna need that in there. I'm gonna go in with the squigglies. Oh God. Oh, okay. He's gonna double it. He's gonna do the what colors? Blue. And he's going to do oh, green. He's on me. Are you making earth, sweetheart? Yep. So what he's going to do is he's going to make earth with blue and green. Oh, I don't know dropping. if he's going to make it look and make it into a ball or not. But then if he wants to, he can leave it dry overnight oh, and it it'll get like hard and we can keep it. It looks like oh, yeah. I need a little bit more. Oh yeah, you definitely do. So, yeah, he can he can definitely let that dry overnight and we can keep it. Now, this food coloring will Stay in your hands. 
just for a little bit, but it will come out of, um, oh, eventually. Wow, it's lot. not going to stain forever. Oh, yeah, she is a lot. Look at that. Look at that big pile on there. ASMR. Now, I'm excited to see how this looks. ASMR. You can see how, you know, it's kind of, you know, it's, it doesn't work like um, food liquid coloring. food coloring, but it is working. So, let's see how it looks after. I'm going to make a little tiny piece red for you my focus brother on. Oh, because okay. he's not here. So, I'm going to, like... Make a little piece for him. Okay, that's awesome. So that way, when uh he when you see him, you can give it to him. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah, he fell asleep, so he's not doing this video with us. But maybe next time he'll oh, be wow. able to. Oh wow! This blue, this powder blue, yeah. just stain your hands. So well, sure. this powdered blue will not stain your hands. When you wash it, it will come off. Okay. Um. Oh, I got some blue on there. But um, yeah, it do, it will come off. It's Look just the liquid ones that stain stain your hands. Look how it's for going. my bottle. I'm gonna let it sit. Yeah. Then it looks fantastic. Ooh. So yeah, I'm gonna do like a swirl. You're gonna do a red swirl. Okay, that's awesome. I'm gonna do okay. Blue. I'm gonna I, do blue, I switched blue, to a plan. Swirl like blue, blue, and then swirl with that one. With what color, sweetheart? Red. Okay, let's see if we can get some out of there because we didn't have a lot I of that. I think I could oh, make. Oh, look at those beautiful dots on there. I okay. think I could make red with. I'm gonna make uh, one part blue, one part green. All right. That, I could, that sounds awesome. I could make purple. <laughs> yes, you could. Red. Oh yeah, we haven't used the purple yet. Can we see the purple before we finish the video up? Yep. Here's the purple. You gotta take oh, the tape off. Oh no, of me. Mama. That's okay, baby. Like I said, guys, this is kind of a messy little project, but with quarantine going on and everything, you know, these kids really need something to do. This is a very fun project. Oh, right it's only three ingredients. Oh, there's the purple. And, you know, it gives them something to do. Mm -hmm. And, you know, they can even learn with it. It's just, it's something fun for the kids to do. Mm -hmm. You know, us mamas during this quarantine time need something to keep our kids busy and I think this project it's a great one it really is you can like I said you can even use it to help your kids learn stuff it's so, basically like school yeah like, I mean you can no. incorporate math with this mm -hmm. you can incorporate science yeah, with this like uh, there's a lot you could do with this reading. and you know like I said us mamas during this quarantine time I have five kids I need something to keep my babies busy, okay? Ooh, and I know I there's a lot purple. of parents that would agree with me, and this is a very easy project that they can do. Come look at this purple. All right, let's look at this purple. Yep. See, I think this is more intended for watery substances, and now we found that out. Um, but that does look good. It looks kind of swirly. I can make purple real quick. Um, some patches. Um, so that's, that's pretty Who neat. Who wants me to see me make purple. What colors do you need for purple, honey? Red and blue. Yes, so absolutely. Don't really have yeah, we're red. a little out of red. So, so anyways, my see? kids are going to keep doing this and they're going to make their little things and let them dry overnight and they can keep them. That's okay, sweetheart. Um, so I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Remember, it's only three ingredients. That is it. Only three. You need, what again do you need, kids? You flour, need flour, salt, salt water, salt, hot water, and salt. salt. Yes. Two cups of flour, one cup of salt, one cup of water, and optional is food coloring. So I really hope you guys love this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. We Thank love you, you all. Bye. Bye.